I could show you $6,000. With $6,000, I could buy a used car. I could buy three busts of the Mandalorian or Boba Fett. I could buy 18 full-size baby Yodas. For $6,000, I could take a cruise around the world for 14 days by myself. For $6,000, I could rent a lady of the night for one night where anything goes. That's right, it's your main man Z here, and I am here to talk to you about the Galactic Cruiser. You know it, I know it. Disney <laughs> has gone full. This is not a good idea. I, I've done other videos about this, which I will link up above where my predictions may come true. But the reviews are out, and you can see here, we have, they brought in influencers, and I guess had a full live run of the opening of the Galactic Cruiser. So we've got some feedback, some reviews, some things we can look at, some spoilers. If you don't want to know what's going on in the hotel, my biggest complaint is the price tag. I think this would be a good thing for fans, but the price tag is way, way, way too high. And uh, for those of you who are new here, uh, please like, subscribe, share this video. It really helps us grow the channel. We're uh, creeping ever higher. And I really appreciate your time here. And let's get back to it. <laughs> this is from Bounding Into Comics. And they do have a little bit of a, uh, of a stint <laughs> or a slant on this where uh, they're saying new videos provide embarrassing first look at, at Disney Star Wars uh, Galactic Cruiser. And um, we'll go through some of it. I, I don't want to like go through the whole thing, but I have watched quite a few videos just to get an idea of what it was. And uh, it does. it seems like an escape room mixed with some dinner theater uh, they let you out in the park to go hunt down some QR codes and you get to save secret passwords and things. So, I mean, look, do I think it's probably fun? Yes. Do I think this is a good look for Star Wars and the brand? Not really. Am I surprised? No. Uh, Disney's going to milk it for all of the green milk it's worth. Or blue milk, your your choice. But let's 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 take a look here and see what's going on. A bunch of new uh, <laughs> new videos. I do think it's hilarious that they're like, check out Chewbacca. You can hang out. You too can hang out with Chewbacca and with your friends and dress up. Except like, you're going to be dressed like a normie and most of the other people there, like, I don't know. Like, it seems like it's immersive, but you won't be that immersed because not everybody's going to dress the part. And there are full stormtroopers there and things like that. Um... Let's see here. It seems the official opening is March 1st, and it already started hitting on the 25th, and I, I know I'm a little late to the show on this one, but uh, let's take a look. This one I'm not going to play the sound on because we talked a little bit about the singer, and um, I think it's just worth watching because I have... Oops. Oh, I'm going to get pulled if I play the music because the music is very important. But <laughs> you can see there's a Rodian backup. Uani is the true queen. That's what this Twitter person says. So they all they cared about, they didn't care about the singer. They cared about this chick who's fake playing the keyboards in a crazy mask. It's not, I don't even think it looks that good. Like I saw closer up pictures of it and it looks a little like subpar. I mean, I, 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 if I'm eating dinner, I don't necessarily want... I don't need the audience or the 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 performers like going around while I'm eating. You know what I mean? Like I, I want to be entertained. I want to see a stage. I'd like to see a performance. I'd like to see cool laser effects and stuff. Or do what they did in everything else you ever see, which is like stick a band in the corner and have the band play. Like I think that would have been much cooler if they had like Snood's Needles or whatever those guys' names are. Max Rebo. 
playing. Like, I don't even care if they're animatronic. I think I said this before, but, you know, you could have done something more interesting than this instead of hiring, like, some crazy performers. Like, what happens if this lady gets sick? I mean, I know the mask lady, she'll be fine, but here's another one. Again, this is, uh, you, you, you could choose your own direction in this. It's like, choose your own adventure. You could be a... Uh, you can either root for the First Order, because of course it's tied to the, the, the new trilogy, right? Of course. Uh, so it's it. <laughs> so you can either be First Order, you can be, I think, a New Republic sympathizer. You can be a scoundrel, which means you're just playing either side, or you can be the Way of the Jedi. I can't imagine people wouldn't pick the Way of the Jedi, but whatever. I'm sure there's some bad people out there. <laughs> whatever you do you do you <laughs> but here's uh again this is a, a sneak peek and, and we'll hear this one Greetings. Mm, open my tiny box you have so look there's tiny Yoda in a hollow projector i guess i mean i guess that's cool you know look they're trying you know it's it's a thing um, apparently there are stormtroopers on board and, uh, I guess they haven't worked out all the kinks. Like, I don't know that this is a joke. Uh, I'm, I would assume based on what I'm seeing here, he's unfurling his flag, but he didn't do it the right way. So he, he like kicks it. Come on, brah. <laughs> like that can't be right. Oh, uh, yes. That's very, the. I guess the I don't know the captain looks so terrible. I feel like what if that lady gets sick? Like I just don't get it. None of it makes any sense to me. I am sure if you went there and you're a Star Wars super fan, you probably had a really good time. Again, it's it's the price tag, and I'm not trying to demean any of the the employees or workers. Look, they're trying their best. You get cast. Good for you. You do you, and uh, best of luck to you. Let's see here a little bit more. You get to see Ray and Kylo. Kylo Ray, Ren Skywalker. Oh, look, they pull her. Hilarious. Even though is she like a full Jedi by this point? I don't know. I I, I have no idea where this fits into the timeline, but I did want to show you some a little like not that great uh, lightsaber dueling. Yes, the spike. <laughs> I mean, they the fans seem to like it. There's no sparks. She just killed Kylo Ren. You know, it's cool. It's the fight choreography is as good as the Last Jedi. So, what are you gonna? Yeah, <laughs> I I, just, I, I struggle to take it seriously. I really do. I really do. Um, if you want to learn some dance moves, apparently you can go to a choreographed dance crew thing. Yeah. Uh huh. Like this is what they've turned Star Wars into. Uh, people are also, I guess, they're complaining a little bit about the size of the cabins. We knew that though. It looks like a ship's cabin. I, I mean, what do you expect? Like it is what it is. Um, I saw some of the food looks kind of interesting. There's like a grilled cheese things. Where the cheese was in like these, like it looked like alien food. All right, that's 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 kind of cool. The only thing I think this this is a little weird. They have uh, blue milk and green milk on tap, right? Okay. Have blue milk and green milk on tap. In Star Wars, do they call it blue milk and green milk? I feel like they would call it something else, but I could be wrong. I mean, maybe it's called. Moo Moo Juice, and I just didn't know that. Two people would have to... It's it's $4,809 US doll hairs. So, what do you think? Do you think this is good? Is this worth the money from what I'm showing you? I hope I didn't give away too much, but I just wanted to give you a taste because uh, I find it fascinating. I like to beat up on Star Wars whenever I get a chance. <laughs> but uh please like subscribe share we would greatly appreciate it we do have a full audio podcast that you can uh download for free on itunes stitcher spotify all those great places um 
We have a lot of stuff going on there. We have some great giveaways you could check out too if you'd like to see. Uh, we, we like to give away digital movies as well. But for myself, here at Our Reviews Will Kill You, I am on to the next one.